The hectic Christmas shopping season is slowly picking up in the capital city and other areas around the country, with many consumers hoping to avoid the last-minute rush. But this is being done against a backdrop of an escalating murder rate and an increase in serious crimes, particularly robberies, leaving many to wonder whether this will impact on Christmas shopping and sales. On Monday, CNC3 ventured into the capital city to get a first and look at what's taking place and spend time with shoppers and business owners alike. And while there is some trepidation about about the country's crime problem, many shoppers insist crime will not dampen their Christmas. Well, you just have to do the usual, you know, hold your purse at the side of you, you know, be more careful and alert what your surroundings. As you shop, you pay things in your car, you know, do the usual things about it. And then, you're always here, you know, you don't walk about with money in your purse and have your money exposed. So I try to do that, so I do feel safe. But nevertheless, they admit to being cautious and concerned about the level of crime in the country. Well, the crime situation is so deep-seated that right now to say enough is being done you know, will really be an understatement. But we need you know, all arms of the society to really take an interest. They can do better than the best. You understand? And to me, they're trying their best. With shoppers ready to spend, some business owners and managers like Mr. Hadid of Kids Rule and Lindy Ann of Bang Bang believe the onus rests on managers to ensure crime does not scare away shoppers or affect Christmas sales. We have more security. We train well most of the staff we try to train them in being more alert around customers, not really to follow them, follow them, but to be more aware because around Christmas time as it's busy, we have a lot of people who come in to shoplift. So we basically have more security and train staff to be more aware. There is there is a lot of police presence. It's not always 24 hours. I mean, but you get it when they're out there, they're out there. But I, I don't think people should have a, be afraid of coming downtown. In fact, many believe that despite the forecast of doom and gloom, sales this season will be favorable. For CNC3, I'm Melissa Williams.